Good morning. Welcome back to Four More Minutes. I am Sam Bailey, the soul stir, stirring up your hearts and your minds for God. I appreciate you joining with us this morning, and I thank you in advance for sharing this message if it encourages you, motivates you, and inspires you. If you have not yet done so, please subscribe to The Soul Stir on YouTube as this is the easiest, most effective way to share these messages. Today, I want to talk about pseudo-humility. And somebody saying, what do you mean by that? Well, pseudo is, is false, it means false, not authentic, not real. And someone will say, how does that connect to humility? Humility is a journey, a path that I'm on, compassion. I think we all should be on that journey toward humility like our Lord and Savior. In a world where upward mobility is taught, emphasized, and practiced, you got to win more, do more, be more, be better than someone else, uh, you know, be seen, be heard, be noticed, be known. Uh, the way that, that God would have us to be lifted up is to go down, right? To lower ourselves, humble ourselves under the mighty hand of God, and in due time, He exalts us. Uh, there are a lot of people who practice pseudo humility. In other words, it's a false, fake type of humility. Humility is not in your posture. Uh, it's not even in the words you say. Humility resides in the heart. Humility is actually release of the need to satisfy people in any other way, anything other than your authentic, genuine self. It's preferring and honor one another. It's deflecting the credit. Uh, it's not needing approval and validation from others or affirmation. And, and sometimes uh, you can see it in, in, in small, subtle ways. It might be someone give you a compliment on something that you do. Oh, no, no, I know it's not me. No, I'm not that. Well, you're denying the gift that God gave you. I think sometimes a simple thank you would suffice. Uh, thank you. I appreciate that. Or give the glory and the honor to God versus, oh, I didn't do that. Sometimes we even put ourselves down in front of other people to make them feel better about their insecurities, about our giftedness, or about our blessings. I tell people all the time, stop apologi apologizing for your blessing. Didn't the Lord promise to bless you uh, if you do things right? Uh, and if you make right decisions, don't apologize for your success. There was a thing going on in churches where people were saying that you shouldn't call a man doctor who's a doctor. Well, he earned the degree. Now, as long as that, that degree is for a, a purpose, specific purpose, if he's not using it uh, to get some kind of advantage over someone else, then it really shouldn't be a problem. But sometimes we make problems, you know, where there are <laughs> no problems. But I, I pray that we would be genuinely uh, people of, of genuine humility, where it's not fault, it's not fake, it's just who we are because we love God. Uh, and it's, it is who we are who we are no matter who we are around uh, That means sometimes people will reject us. Sometimes people won't appreciate us. Sometimes you have to swallow your pride uh, And 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 do it because you're the bigger person you're the bigger woman or the bigger man uh, Not not a fake sense of now if, if you have this pseudo humility It's gonna come out as sometimes it's not the real thing but life will put us in times where you thought you were humble until somebody says something or something happens and you realize I'm not where I ought to be and I'm not what I ought to be. So thank God it gives us the opportunity to, to, to do that. Don't put yourself down. That's that's fake, especially if you don't believe it on the inside. Don't give God the glory and the honor. And remember, we all have to humble ourselves under the mighty hand of God. I always say it's better to stay down than to have somebody else put you down. And I always say, too, it's hard to hit a low and moving target. So stay low and keep moving. Don't don't settle into one place too long and, and don't take the glory and the honor for yourself. People will do a lot of things to you that aren't fair and aren't right, but you got to keep on going anyway. God bless you. Have a wonderful day today. Share this with somebody else. Internalize it in your heart, and we'll see you next time right here on 4 More Minutes. Thank you.